I just want to thank you guys for voting on the poll and uh, also a big thank you for liking my newest video this past Thursday called Deadly Double Features. Um, I'll be doing more as time goes on. Um, that's why it says episode one. I actually enjoyed it and I got good feedback so I'm pretty happy about that. But today I'm doing a review because Mondays are reviews um, and... The review today is a movie I got not that long ago. This is a double feature from Screen Factory, and that is The Curse. Um, did not watch The Curse 2 yet, but from the looks of it, it looks completely different from The Curse. Um, I looked it up on IMDb, and supposedly it has nothing to do with the first movie. Um, the first movie has a slightly older Will Wheaton. Um, if you guys aren't familiar with Will Wheaton, his probably most known role is um, in Stand By Me which is a good Stephen King adaptation. But The Curse, um, you follow this meteorite that ends up crashing down onto this farm and it produces this, like, um, bacteria almost that goes into the water and contaminates the water and turns the family into, like, like just gross... Um, not even creatures just they end up getting gross and um snapping and the animals snap like the cows and they're rotting from the inside all the vegetables and the fruits are rotting and it's craziness um definitely a really good movie one that I never really knew about until watching somebody doing um a, a not a review, but like a video on YouTube of their Screen Factory collection. They mentioned this double feature. And this is an out of print double feature. I got this um, for a pretty good price. I'm not going to say the price because I don't think you guys really need to know the price and stuff. I <laughs> um, just know I got it for a good price. But um, yeah, this is a out of print double feature. I wish Screen Factory, I know with like 4K and everything, it's highly unlikely but I wish Screen Factory would come back to their double features because they have some good double features I have and a lot of their double features are out of print too um there's one I really want to get my hands on that's the Summer Party Massacre 2 and 3 double feature but I do have the 4k double feature and then I have three on DVD but totally off topic but The Curse is definitely a must-watch movie I don't think it's streaming anywhere because I check usually when I when I do these reviews, I check to see if they're available streaming. So that way, if you guys don't own it, own these films, that you get a chance to watch them. Um, I, didn't, I did not see it streaming anywhere, so um, I don't think it's available anywhere. Unless you get your hands on this Blu-ray. But like I said, it's out of print and some people are asking crazy amounts on eBay. But occasionally you'll come across a good... Uh, good copy this is um brand new factory sealed too so win-win there but yeah that's pretty much what the curse is about um like like I said it's this uh, this stuff that gets into the water and ends up like contaminating the whole farm it just that farm area and it, Will Wheaton's character him and his little sister are the only ones that are affected so everyone else in his family is affected by this water and 
Uh, yeah, that's pretty much all the movie is about. Like I said, in The Curse 2, I have not seen, but from the looks of it, it looks like a killer snake movie. And from the back, it says it's a killer snake movie, and it has Jill Sholin in it, who is most known from for being in The Stepfather and Popcorn, which I absolutely love Popcorn. But, yeah, The Curse. Pretty good 80s movies. Came out, came out in 1987. Um, but, yeah. If you, like I said, if you haven't watched it, try to find it somewhere or buy it if you're willing to spend the money. Um, but yeah, that's really all I have to say. I hope you guys enjoyed. Shortly after this review gets posted, I will be putting more movies on the poll. So stay tuned for that and stay tuned for Thursday. I'm trying to figure out what to do exactly for Thursday, but stay tuned for that. But in the meantime, I will see you guys then.